what's up guys my name is Fallon I'm bringing another video and this is H1Z1 and I just wanted to play a little bit and show you guys a little bit about this game even though I post up a video already about this this is a little video of me just actually talking and not actually streaming it just me actually just playing with the face cam on honestly this game slightly is a disappointment but at the same time you can't blame it because this is the brand new game and it's a brand new release but then again at the same time while looking at that it does have a lot of fuck ups like a lot like there's burps hiccups and shits all over the fucking place it's kinda sad cause there's some like simple shit like the spawns of weapons of how you can't find shit and how you can pay to play the game basically to get better shit like if I call in an air drop it'll land right in fucking front of me or it'll land down the street basically from me and it's kinda funny how accurate it is and how it should be completely random not based on your location or who can spend five bucks per drop I don't have time to spend five dollars per drop to just die and lose it basically and I don't have but other people seem to actually have time and money to do that over and over but I don't and it's unfair to me because I actually paid the twenty dollars to play this game not to play and get the person who can just spawn in shit versus me basically trying to search for shit that isn't existing that's the only thing I liked about Daisy. when you try to look for shit most likely any building I go into I would find like an axe or some shit the reason it looks so dark right now is because of my settings I can't mess with my settings right now because for some reason I can't run this game in ultra I can run DayZ in the highest setting possible or high I'm pretty sure it's high it doesn't have an ultra setting but I can't run this in ultra for some reason because it will mess up my streaming or my recording either or it will mess it up completely and I don't know if it's a thing with the game or it's just me just fucking up completely on my computer but I'm pretty sure it's not my computer, cause I can run every other game, like Crisis and all that, in Ultra, with no problems, and record at the same time. So it's probably something wrong with this game, but I don't blame it. It's first day out. Can't really be too angry or frustrated. Flaws do happen in brand new games, so you really can't get too angry at it. Even though this is a spitting clone of DayZ, yet again, it is not DayZ. Cause there's some things in this I really would prefer if DayZ had, like it would make the game spectacular. Like DayZ, I swear, it's a fucking run fest. You run for like... 30 minutes to die and a bunch of DayZ is basically KOS if any of you know what that means kill on sight unlike this game when I find people they usually do not kill me but I think that's gonna change by next week because it's a brand new game and most people don't have weapons but people who do have weapons I see that they don't actually use them to kill people they use them to their advantage to threaten people like every person I've run across I don't know how the fuck that even hurt me Every person I've run across has like a bow, they use it to threaten me, not to kill me, because the accuracy is horrible with a bow and it doesn't do that much damage. Surprisingly, I haven't found anyone, because these servers are usually butt fucked with money, so many people, it's stupid to get in. It takes me like, the top server took, what, three hours to get inside? That was the queue waiting time? Fuck that shit, I don't have time for that. That's bullshit. One little thing that I liked about DayZ that was not present in this game is how you can base. Fuck that damage shit. Basically, how you can hop servers with a different character, with the same character, I found that actually entertaining and fun because I can go play with my friend on this server, go play with my friend on that server. On this, it's a different pro approach to it. I'm not hating it, but it's a different approach. Basically, it goes like this: If I want to go play on my other server with my friend, I have to start a new, whole brand new character. But if they come to my server, basically, or I stay on my server, I keep all my stuff. So every time I switch a server, it's a brand new character. But it does not affect my other characters, which is I find entertaining how they can actually keep slots for other characters on so many different servers. Meaning that these servers are actually good, but yet again so bad at the same time with the C or G99 error that was so present in the beginning of this game. That's what I spent most of my time doing, playing the G99 error for 4 hours straight during a release which has been delayed for about 2 hours. Oh look, Civilization. Bullshit. This is not going to be good. I don't know my guy's not running for His stamina is down for some apparent reason, even though he hasn't been really running to be honest. And for some reason, I can't catch any of this rain. I'll show you the main flaw I have with this game, as you can see. Watch. You'll see me search this whole entire place and probably come out empty-handed as fuck. Dark as fuck. And then the delay with the open doors and shit. That's so annoying. Okay. Can I even search any of this? I know I can probably search that, right? Wait for it. Wait for the, the prompt. Nope. No fucking prompt. Yo, everything looks fucking hard. Hey, you got a mic? How you doing, man? How you doing, man? I can't find shit. So if you're coming here to look for shit also, there's nothing here. I hear other voices here. Did you come here with friends? 
Oh, there's some people outside, I assume, because I heard voice. Someone's chat's going. Yeah, he's right there. Hey, you got a mic? Got a mic? Friendly? As you can see, this is what I mean. Basically, every person you meet, it really is friendly. But you do meet those one stranglers once in a while. There's someone over here, too. Got a mic? Whoever this is going into the auto body shop? Oh, never mind, fell. Yeah, I can't find shit. If you find shit, holy shit, I'm amazed. As you can see, everyone's friendly, to be honest. I have no problem with that. It's actually kind of fun that you guys can communicate with people and try to work together and actually get shit. Wow. Okay. Um, it's kind of dark in here. That was unnecessary. Zombies are very unaggressive, if you haven't noticed. And retarded. That. I'm right behind you. Here, I'll make noise. I'll make noise. I'll punch the wall. Do you hear me yet? Do you? Here, I'll punch you one time. Do you hear me? No, you don't? I'm gonna punch you again. You gonna, come, you gonna turn around? No, no, that's not me. Here, I'll punch you a few more times. Combo fucking breaker. You gonna come after me now? No, you're stuck in that room. You're confused? I'm only staring you dead in the face. The awkward moment of this game is so, it's like beyond me. Oh, finally, you're coming out the room. Holy shit. You're going the wrong spot, dude. Fucking retarded. Anyway, moving on. <sighs> this game really baffles me. I'm confused sometimes. It's just like, the same shit that happens in this game just, just doesn't make sense. I looked on Reddit and seen a bunch of shit how bad this game has been going down the drain. How well people have been calling in airstrikes and shit up on themselves and they can just pick up weapons and they're locked and loaded and good to go. That shit bothers me completely. <sighs> wow. Oh, finally. Something edible. Wow. Surprise. Can I actually eat it now, though? That's the interesting part. Let's look at my health and my stamina and shit. Let's see how fast that goes up. Oh, 66%, not bad. I actually did something actually worth the time. Let's see. Anything else here present? Come on. Search shit. Empty. Wow, what a fucking surprise. Not much to it. That's the only disappointing thing about this game. When I was watching the live stream earlier, before the game came out, it was a restream or a rebroadcast of another Twitcher doing their thing. But when they played, I seen them do so much shit, and how they had so many weapons and stuff, how they could find so much shit so easily. But as I could play it now, it's so scarce. I don't know if it's even scarce, or it's just not spawning. That's the difference. I'm on a medium server. It's not even a high server anymore. I've been dropping down to see if I can actually collect stuff. I look on Reddit again, and I see other people saying they found, like, 15 guns in 20 minutes. I call horse shit on that completely, because I can't even find a damn axe. Or a knife. I found, when I was playing through earlier, about well, the video you see earlier on my channel, I don't know if you're going to go look at it. It's like 30 minutes long. But as you can see in the video, I found uh, a hunting knife, a combat knife, I think. It was one of them. Or a machete. I killed somebody for the bone arrow. Yeah, I'm more of a bandit, to be honest, let it be known right now. The only reason I'm a bandit is because there's people that are like really friendly and they have a ton of shit. And no offense, I really don't want to go look for that shit. It took me forever. Like right now, I, I'm, I'm out of stamina. Honestly, I would love to just like kill myself. Oh my god, the server. Fuck. How do you kill yourself? It will be much appreciated if I can find a way to just end this right now. No, f not trying to sound very creepy or anything like that. I just feel like this is going on forever. I can't find shit. <sighs> Fuck. Let me see if these guys are still over here. I can get one of them to kill me. Is anyone here still alive? Anyone? Anyone present? If you're present, I'll give you a Twinkie. Who's that coming towards me? You have a mic? Suffocation, turn around. Can you kill me real quick? Kill me. I want to spawn somewhere else. This is bullshit. Kill me. Just beat the shit out of me. I will sit here. Just kill me. Just kill me. I'll, I'll pay you to kill me, damn it. You get all my shit, just kill me. Or, oh wait, is this a zombie? Kill me. I can't even tell, it's so fucking dark. Shit. Change the fucking settings to medium. Let's see if I can fucking can handle that shit. Yeah. 
Fuck me up. Fuck me up. I can take a punch. Fuck me up. Thank you. <sighs> now let's be spawning magically in the woods next to some like six random people. Oh fuck. Still dark as shit. Can I change the settings? I don't understand how that changes the brightness like like at all. If I change that, does it change the brightness? Nope. Ah oh, fuck it. What if I change the settings completely? Does it affect it does it affect my recording? Ultra. Yep, it affects it completely. It treats you like shit. Look how fucking fucked up my sh my recording looks now. Uh, fuck. The things I do for love. Yes. What's up? What's up? You made that sound very sketchy, sir. Oh man. I just wanna be friends. Okay. We can be friends from a distance. Do you know where the city is? Yeah. Huh? I do. Follow me. Okay. I'm assuming you're new? Hmm, hold on, give me a second. I just need to find a road. Don't try no funny business back there. Yeah, it's like, it's kind of like Daisy. You can hear me now? Yeah. It's for judging the distance of how far someone is away from you if they try to attack you. So if I try to bullshit you and I'm saying I'm a sniper and I'm right fucking next to you, you can tell me that I'm lying basically. Most people don't know that though. Help me find, if you can help me find a road, we're good to go. I can tell you any, anything from there. I feel like this guy's gonna kill me on some real shit, all bullshit aside. Because for some reason, the way he made that sound was so sketchy and unbelievable that I would not, like, even inch towards his direction. What the fuck? Hello? Yeah, anyway, that guy seems very sketchy and unbelievable. It's kind of, like, weird. I don't trust him, but as soon as I find a weapon, I'm gonna keep all eyes on him, and I want him to run in front of me. I don't trust him now, but I don't have shit on me, and he doesn't have shit, so there's no point to kill each other. Hopefully we can find civilization, we can find some other people, because if he acts up and I have other people around me, we can fuck him up real quick. Continuing on, hopefully that's- is that the road right there? I don't know how to do the zoom feature in this game. Usually the zoom feature. Hold on. Do I have it? Nope. Fuck no. Wait. Let me see these words. No locks. No. 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 Nope. Fuck the num locks. Ah. Oh, fuck. Fuck. It's like Daisy. Fuck. Fuck. Oh. Oh. I was holding the all button down by accident. I'm retarded. Well, this isn't a road. This water and rain in a puddle. Fuck. I know the stream or this recording is a little bit laggy, but I apologize for the inconvenience and it's bullshit. But I cannot handle this game for some odd reason, even though my PC is upgraded to the like maximum, except for my graphics card, which is a 270x or R9 Radon 270x. Sounds shitty, but then it's coupled with the 4790K. So it's just like, I'm, I'm, I'm confused. 
it should be able to run this a little bit better than this, or a little bit smoother without the multitasking between the recording and also the game. The hyper threading should have kicked in, and I don't know, maybe I'm talking wrong, and maybe I don't know what I'm talking about, but the hyper threading should have helped out a lot here. Where, where, where the figgy fuck is a road? This shit is like Daisy all over again. Is he still behind me? Oh, fuck that, dude. Is that an axe? Dude. Can you hear me? Hey, can you hear me? Kid behind me, do you have an axe? This kid is sketchy to the motherfucker. I don't trust his ass. I don't trust his fucking ass. The moment I find a weapon, I'm fucking killing him. Dude, I, I'm pretty sure I just saw him with an axe. Fuck that. Dude, do you have a mic? I find this bullshit. Ah, oh, fucking shit. Wait, I'll let the off the road. Is this guy still behind me? Hopefully he's not because I really am gonna kill him. All the bullshit aside, that kid will die if I see him. And I pick up a weapon. I don't have time for bullshit games. I'm gonna start walking it a little bit. Do a little stamina saving. Try and get my stamina up while I'm doing this. Stamina slowly regenerates. Which I'm not complaining about. I'm in bujik forms. I'm happy that it tells you above your head. It's not no bullshit. Bougie forms. I enter bougie forms from going into there, right? Okay, it's not gonna tell me again, but okay. Okay, so I go here. Roxy, the karaoke burned down. We're heading north. Bougie forms. Where's bougie forms? The fuck is this? This doesn't help me at all. Unless I'm stupid and I'm not reading it. I don't see bullshit fucking farms on this shit. Oh, there it is. Oh, I'm retarded. Oh. Oh well. Well, bullshit farms. So if I head north, right? Okay, so I should hit the town. I'm entering Bougie Farms going in there, right? That's where it should be, right? Let's cross a bridge. Where's, am I, do I continue that way? I think I continue this way. I think so. This is a mountain to be another day Z. Run for miles. Like, it's not even, like, so much, like, if that makes sense, it's through the, the car. That makes sense. I see you. You got a mic? I see you both. You have a mic? You have a mic, either one of you? Do you, either of you have a mic? You have a mic? Oh, City, you have a mic, right? Oh, fuck that shit. 
city. I'm gonna leave. That guy's acting really sketchy. I don't trust City at all in the slightest. He keeps fucking following me and shit. And he makes pulls out his machete when he gets close to me. That's bullshit. Don't do that shit to me. I keep telling you that. Well, he's gonna make a mistake of dying. If he comes near me again with that shit and I have a weapon in my hand, I will definitely kill him on sight. No hesitation. His name is City. He will die. I don't know if you guys like this recording or even me playing this game, but if you are watching this, I do appreciate it, actually. Take the time to actually hit that like button or share the video. I love playing this game just a little bit because it reminds me of DayZ, and DayZ is fun as shit. It just has so many fucking bugs for a game that's been going on for like two years, even though it's still a standalone. Or it's still in beta or alpha, whatever you call it. It's still not up to par where it should be in two years. And also paying like $40 for it. I'm paying twenty dollars for this. And I feel like I already got more out of it than DayZ. DayZ is basically a mob of people just fucking you up because they know where everything fucking spawns. Now you can just hop servers and grab it if they don't get it to spawn. This game actually takes time. It's like actually a uh, real zombie survival, which I actually appreciate that so the time they actually put into it. But they need to put a lot more fucking time into it to make it a game that's actually worth buying, or let alone even fucking playing. But that's just my opinion, of course, even though I'm a little being a little harsh and being truthful for a game like this, especially for you to add a pay-to-play service, or a pay-to-win service, basically, an initiative, even though this is going to become free in six months, I highly doubt that it should be free in six months unless they actually fix the fucking problems. I paid $20 for a pile of shit. I paid $40 for a pile of shit, aka DayZ. But I do not regret either one of them because they're actually fun. But that's my opinion, of course. Your opinion might be a lot different. Found the city, of course. After taking my time to actually pay attention to that fucking map, I was just half retarded on. Let's see what they have. I'm probably going to find nothing, as always. Hudson Valley or Pleasant Valley. Let's go. Let's give me one second. Let's see. <sighs> Judging from the zombies in a populated town such as this, I've learned from DayZ that you also need to search everything because this is a place that has a lot of shit. That's the reason there's so many zombies here to prevent you from getting all that good shit. So, I'm most likely saying in this in this place in the future, it's going to be the highly populated place full of tons of shit you can loot and it'll be perfect for you. The thing I like about this that has advantages over DayZ is also the vehicles. That's actually a smart idea. DayZ needs vehicles. People told me that there's vehicles in DayZ, but it's very rare for you to get your hands on it. I highly doubt it because I've never played with a vehicle, let alone see a vehicle that can actually be driven. And I've seen a shit ton of DayZ gameplay. Zombies, yet again, not aggressive. Oh, one fucking zombie's aggressive. Holy shit, fucking two dams and titty fucks. Let's continue on. Oh, this is a vehicle that you can drive, luckily. Hey, but watch this. Bet you one thing. Bet you one thing. You want to have a quick laugh, people? Can't drive the shit. Can't fucking drive the shit. Oh, Pleasant Valley Police. Or, oh, my God. Completely messed up. Pleasant Valley Police. It's a police station, so let alone if you have guns. Let's see. Let's see if my cue is correct. Let's see if you have guns. You should have guns. If you don't, that's bullshit. There should be a weapons locker in here somewhere. This isn't a real police station. Police station's vault should be downstairs, correct? Downstairs? Here it is. Okay, weapons cabinet. That should be a weapons cabinet, right? It's fucking empty. Fucking empty. Oh, mm hmm. Well, guys, that sounds like my basically playthrough of fucking this game. Don't tell me I can search all these. Holy shit. I can search every one of them one by one to find nothing. Wow.
Wow, this place is dirty as fuck. Okay. This is only jail. Kind of creepy to have that in here. Oh. You just chilling, dude? You guys just chilling? Have a nice day. I guess having a nice day. You guys have a nice day now, yo. Young folks, you just go out there and have some nice fun, alright? You know, you know. Have some nice fun. Grab some coffee on your way up, mm hmm. What's this place? A food place? Actually, let's see if there's actually any food here. I need some food at the moment, anyway. Get my hydration and my health up. Let's see. Let's break these real quick. I have an easier time breaking this with my hands. Easier hands. Easier with the hands. I don't question games anymore. I just go along with them. I'm surprised not to see anyone here. This is the high server and nobody's in the, a very big ass town. I'm making my presence known. Is anyone here? Anyone present? Alive? Anything? Fuck you, zombie. I was gonna go out that way. Anyone alive? Hmm, that'd be use. I'll take that. Nope. No oh, water bottle. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Definitely need that. Is that food right there I can take? Oh fuck yeah. So I'm gonna loot this place, right? I'm trying to see if there's any people around here. I'm surprised there's nobody here. I can't find anyone. I'm surprised there's no actual guns in the police station. Sad enough. But I'm not gonna let that bother me. I'm not gonna let that affect my judgment of this beautiful, completely crafted game. Let it alone. It does have a better engine than fucking DayZ. Shit. I know I compare them a lot in this video, guys. I do know that. Please do not post that in the comments if you do watch this by any chance. I do know that, but I compare it to it because it's another game that stands up top tier next to this game. It's only the game you can actually compare it to. The fuck is this shit? The fuck is... What the fuck? Don't... Oh my god. The fuck was that? How does shit, how does that shit even happen? What kind of act, fuck. <laughs> you know zombies didn't kill your ass. Hey dude, I see you. What you doing? Hey man, you got a mic? Got a mic, man? Got a mic in there? I just want to know, tell you that I'm friendly. I'm friendly. Surprised you didn't kill me, like I said. Surprising about this game. There must be a lot of new people who are not used to the DayZ era of how it's KOS all the fucking time. I'm gonna stop this recording soon so you guys can continue actually which on with your lives and not waste your whole entire time watching a guy like me play this game which is amazing if attack is a color amazing la 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 oh my god hold on let me search these shits hold on I, I, I can't stop the video here there's like seven refrigerators I got what the fuck bitch please bitch please bitch please fuck you both fuck you both that's bullshit the more I find something that's slightly entertaining to me in any type of way possible, you guys all decide to storm that one store. Bullshit. Fuck you, zombies. Fuck you, zombies. No one has time for your bullshit. I wonder if I had climbed that wire tower, I could actually stay up there. It'd be funny if I could actually chuck rocks at the bottom and actually kill people like that. Sniper some rocks out. Game time! Hey, man, you got a mic? Hey, man, you got a mic? 
another thing that I really need that this game needs to be fixed is that I can conceal weapons on myself. Even though you can see that I have no weapons on me, even though I have a snipe and a crowbar. That needs to be fixed ASAP. That's a horrible thing in the game. Because if I see someone coming towards me, I'm going to assume they're friendly because they don't have any shit on them. I really hope it's not the same thing for guns. If someone has a gun on them, I hope it actually shows. I can actually see that they have a gun on them so I don't be afraid. Hey, dude, do you have a mic? Rule number one. No one lives. Hey, man, you got, you got a mic? Got a mic? Uh, I just got here with you. I just saw you running, so I decided to follow you. So I don't know. I think the reason people were not killing on site, I didn't want to kill the guy because that's fucked up. He didn't attack me. He has a mic. He's talking. If you can hear, can you hear me still? Yeah, he has a mic. He's talking. He's actually doing his own thing. I have no problem with that. And I want people to know it's bad to KOS, honestly, because you can't hop servers and, like, keep your shit. So if you stay on this server, I'm going to forever know your name. Like, I'm going to forever fucking kill you. Like, no matter what. Like, even if you say you were friendly one day, I will fucking kill you every time. Now, I won't waste my... Like, I won't go out of my way to save bullets on your ass. I'll just kill you. Oh, shit. Found bullets. Didn't expect that shit. Didn't expect myself to find some bullets. That shit was very exasperating. Can I search that? Oh, oh, surprise, nothing. Fuck. Oh, shit! Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit, oh, shit. Okay, let's just keep that holstered. Let's hide that bad boy. So far, so anyone who wants to know, I found this in a supermarket. This is Pleasant Valley, I'm pretty sure. So anyone who actually comes here, I'm going to test it on this guy right here. Two shots, didn't die, okay. Got him. What the fuck? Let me hit that too. Drink that. Thank you, dude. Much appreciated. Even though you died, you died for a cause. I can see that the ammunition works perfectly. I didn't expect myself to find a gun in a place like this. It's actually kind of interesting to find a gun in a random place like this, but then again, that's supposed to be the aspect of the game, to find shit in random places to actually help you out. So I actually go searching in random odd places for shit like this. I actually commend that for a game like this. Beauty. Is that ammo right there? That's a can. How do you leave this place? Now that I have a weapon, I can find myself actually protecting myself against anyone. Anyone who poses as a threat, I'll kill. On sight. I'm going to end the episode here, but guys, if you guys like this video, like, comment, subscribe, share this video, and get it out there. Hit that like button. It'd be much appreciated for my channel. Also, the fuck is that? That better not be a glitch. Yeah, it's a glitch. Yeah.